About 30 enthusiastic high school students from Southwest Alberta received hands-on medical instruction during a Health Careers Exploration event at Pincher Creek Healthcare Centre on April 12th. Hosted by the new Pincher Creek Health Professions Attraction and Retention Committee and sponsored by the Rural Health Professions Action Plan, the goal of the day was to expose students to healthcare in a rural environment. Local health professionals introduced participants to the broad range of skills health providers and rural communities are expected to use every day, including ultrasound, suturing, EMS, and respiratory therapy. Research findings on the rural health workforce show that those who either grow up rurally or have been exposed to rural practice during their post-secondary studies are most likely to work in rural communities. So these activities not only support local students, but support our future rural healthcare workforce. The day is a success, bringing in students from Pincher Creek, Crow's Nest Pass, Lundbrook, and Fort McLeod High Schools. I've always been really interested in going into healthcare, and so I want to learn kind of as much as I can before I'm in grade 12, and I gotta really decide what I want to do. I always hated hospitals and needles, but I think it's kind of changed now that I've taken this, and it's, it was interesting. I today was working with um, Elise, one of the uh, ultrasound technicians from Radiology Associates in Westbridge, and so I've done a little bit of extra training, and so she kind of went through what ultrasound sonographer does on a day-to-day -day basis where I kind of touched on a little bit of different things, how we used ultrasound in the emergency room um, for procedures and IV placements and things like that. Squeeze this, squeeze the drip chambers, squeeze it and release it. I actually got to like get a hands-on experience with like suturing and seeing how the lungs work and like blood vessels in the heart. I found that my favoriteest part. I've never had a hands-on experience like that before really. Like I kind of have, but it wasn't like the pig and stuff like that. Like that was really cool to um, kind of have, like almost kind of real, but not. I'm sure most high school students don't know much about an ultrasound sonographer or anything like that. So just being exposed to that and learning what different options are out there so people can find what they think is best for them and hopefully find a career that they'll enjoy doing the next however many years. I know some people migrate because I'm in grade 12. They still don't know what they want to do yet. So like this day maybe would help them push on what they want to do. It really opens your eyes to all the different options you can take. It's not just like being a doctor or being a nurse. There's definitely a lot of things that go on in the hospital and a lot of jobs that you can go, and a lot of paths you can take. So I definitely recommend to my friends. We have a good community and the Pinger Creek Hospital is a, a great facility, I believe. Yeah, so I'd love to come back and work. I think the research shows that Individuals from rural backgrounds are more likely to return to rural areas, so doing days like today is, I think, important to help kind of bolster those rural physicians and other healthcare professionals in the future. Mm -hmm.